So here we are in my fun house, and I'm gonna tell you how to buy a right board for what your needs are. And this is a phenomenal board, which is a very classic vintage style. It's got the uh, very hard edges on the tail, lots of V, a lot of tail rocker. It swing turns, but it accelerates. If you're a surfer who bends his knees, pushes through the turns, make sure you get this, because there's the ripster and the tipster, and there's a little bit of confusion in those two shapes. The round rails drag, nose ride really good, you swing and pivot turn. This one, you bend your knees and push through the turn. It has a gorgeous template, and this, our glass jobs are just gorgeous. This one is outstanding. So when you go to buy a board like this, you know, you wanna go between nine and 10 feet. You wanna have some thickness. Most of these are poly, they're a bit heavy because you want that momentum. Having momentum gives you drive through the sections and stuff. Now this gigantic fin, this is the 10 inch swing. That's right, swing. So this fin, the purpose of why it's so deep is so when you're hanging 10 on the nose, it doesn't side slip out of the pocket. It just holds that line. You don't want any side slipping on a board like this. So when you go to buy one, make sure you get it long enough for your height, your weight, and where you surf. Smaller people should go with the 9-0, the bigger people should go with the 10-0, but this board here is absolutely phenomenal. We sell thousands of these, and they're a phenomenal board. Give it a test pilot at our shop uh, here in San Clemente and uh, demo it. All right, thank you.